Need Those to look save like them. some immaculate strawberries, I will say. They I look pretty tasty. I went and bought them like two days I ago. I feel like I need to dive in. Hey, what's up everybody? Jemai Webster here with Red Sox first baseman Tristan Casas. And he's gonna give us a peek behind the curtain to what makes him the best major leaguer he can possibly be. We're gonna go with what's inside his game ready bag. So what do we got here, Tristan? So first things first is the bat. I got my, my model right here. It was an I-13 base. I put a little more stretch in the barrel to make it a little bigger here. I put a little thicker uh, uh, handle because I do have big hands. I don't want to feel like I'm wrapping my hands around the bat. I renamed the model instead of I-13, My-13T. So this Customized is, it. Yeah, so I used to swing a 34, 31 because that was what my aluminum bat was. So going into the pro ball, I was like, I'm not going to change anything. Went and I uh, wanted to add a little bit of weight because I felt like I got a little stronger since, you know, I graduated high school. So it was ready to take it off and pop down the right field line. Costs us a long run and he'll make the play. I got my glove right here. I keep it really simple with the with the embroidery, just a block letter white. Um, Casas with the with the red and then the navy blue stitching. I got my batting gloves. Um, shout out to Franklin; they hooked me up so so heavily. Um, how often do you change these? It depends. How, it depends how I'm hitting. It depends okay. how I'm hitting. Cause yesterday I had a couple strikeouts and another pair, and they're gone. So this is a new pair coming out for today. Um, so thankfully they blessed me with enough pairs yeah. to be picky. So you get rid of the strikeout yeah, gloves. Throw no, those no, out. No, yeah. So <laughs> huge on the leather palm because. Chandler does a really good job with the gloss finish on their bats. So leather palm with the gloss finish is a super immaculate combo. Um, I like these BGs right here. They're really stylish, little swaggy with the American flags on the Olympian, of course. We got like four in here, which is great. Yeah. Did a little chrome right there with some camo. Those are pretty sick. Under the batting glove, major key right here. Put this on my hand to protect my handmate bone. Um, I wear it for every at bat, every practice, uh, just to protect my hands a little bit more. I used to get like a big callus right here. Uh, I'm, not, I'm sure you've seen other baseball players like with some really bad hands but that that pad right there keeps me honest What's the importance of this thing here? okay so it's uh it's a little bit of an insulator where i'll b get jammed and i won't feel that that vibration from the bat as much whether it's on the end or or on the towards the label a little jam get up that one smoked deep right field sailing back and that ball is out of here i'm gonna go with white elbow guards this year um, I did do a little customization within the white. Uh, what you got? Just, just my last name, just a slight little number right there, 3636. Three, six. Thankfully, I have a number now, so I can put a number yeah. on my stuff. Most important thing, the helmet. Gotta have that. Gotta have the, gotta have the right helmet, the, or the right wear. But you gonna wear it backwards? The this main year? thing in the dugout. Big snacker. Big snack guy. Gotta have the fruits. I don't know how people go three hours in a game without eating. Yeah. I feel like. You should be more concerned if I wasn't eating in the dugout my berries. So how, how, mu how much have these become a necessary part of your routine, the things that you need to do to, to be such a productive hitter? Well, to be honest, it's like it's almost like if I don't have this equipment, I feel like I can't do the job. Carp a carpenter needs his tools and I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm really bought in into these brands, um, into these specific um, styles. Uh, I love the work that these, these, these guys do for me, and uh, yeah, I can't see myself using any other brands. All right, Tristan, well, thanks so much for giving us a peek inside what's in your bag, what makes you a major leaguer, and put you in the conversation for Rookie of the Year last year. We're looking for many more things from you. Thank you, Hopefully Jamai. a lot of hits in this bat this year, man. I'll get that back to you. I don't want to uh, mess up the mojo.